Good Wednesday morning to you, gang. This is Rusty78609, alive and in Technicolor from Fort Davis, Texas, on a cool morning. It's like 62 degrees out there. A little cloudy in the east, but the rain has moved on out. We had a good rain here in Fort Davis, Texas area, and we needed it. And uh, that's on the watershed. Uh, well, further south of us is on the watershed of the Rio Grande. Maybe, maybe the Rio Grande will fill up Lake Amistad and see how that goes. But anyway... Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after yesterday, day before tomorrow, Whew. right now, and right now just went right on by. So if there's anything you want to do, you better be doing it. Guarantee you. And today, uh, let's see what else. Uh, never worry about what you cannot change, as in don't watch the news. Why? It's a waste of time. But uh, what else? Uh, been living in an RV a long time. Everybody knows that. And uh, what else? Uh, for the nooner today, I'm going to drive over to uh, McDonald Observatory, uh, Fort Davis. Well, they say Fort Davis, Texas, but it's about, ooh, 17 miles over there, I guess, 15 miles. It's it's a pretty good drive through the mountain. Yeah, you go right through the heart of the Davis Mountain. So I'll do a little driving video to there, and then we may do a little bit, another video while I'm there. But you can see a picture of the observatory here right there it's on top of mountaintop which most of them are but anyway the university of texas at austin runs that program so and oh, for for your for your for the noon video today that, that i'll do that video today but i'll post it tomorrow but the noon video today i'm going to go to marfa uh, I, I mean I, I i drove over to marfa yesterday and did a driving video so we'll we'll do that one so today you get marfa tomorrow you'll get McDonald Observatory, hopefully. Anyway, if the road ain't washed out, which I know it ain't. But anyway, what else? Uh, hey, Google, tell us a joke. How know. does Darth Vader like his chocolate on the dark side? All right. And this positive energy button, I've been doing it. Learn from yesterday, live for today, and hope for tomorrow. Okay. Here you go. This little girl I bought this thing. This co cost me five bucks. A little girl in Capitan, New Mexico made this for me. Dream it. Wish it. Do it. <laughs> okay, I got it. Dream it. Wish it. Do it. I'm doing it, babe. As far as finding a place here in uh, Fort Davis, no way, no panada. That means it ain't happening. No, no luck so far. There's some lots for, that are coming up for sale uh, soon. But they're not in an area I want to be, that's for sure. And uh, so uh, we'll, we may end up, I may end up just be back down to uh, Brackettville, go from, uh, well, I may come here a, a month and stay in an RV park uh, every now and then because it's, it's a nice area. I like Fort Davis area. The climate uh, year round is pretty good. And so anyway, let's do some comments, Rusty. That's why we're here. Anyway, this is Tariq A., says that driver at the end of the video was a jerk yeah that was uh the yeah that person almost cut me off there in Ruidoso. yeah they did they almost hit me actually but anyway snowy bells 12 howdy rusty super nice drive love it thank you for sharing always be safe well i try i try and here's our man from wisconsin scotty thompson cool video top cool comment call it says do you watch sports on tv rusty Scotty, you've asked me that a few times, and I'm going to answer it. No. No, I did watch golf, but they've even made, they've even, even ruined golf. I mean, I didn't think they'd be able to ruin golf, but they did. You know, now the, the Saudis got into it. You know, they bought their way into using our money uh, from, buy, we, we buy their oil products at a premium price, and then they use it against us. So, anyway, enough said about that. Uh, no, I don't watch sports. Don't uh, n none of them. None. Now, uh, Sandy Handy, catchy name. I bought a twenty-two Coleman. Is I bought a twenty-two twenty twenty-two Coleman. Is and have not aired it out, and started living in it with the windows closed and the air conditioner on blast. Is it okay? I is it okay? Have I shortened my lifespan? I, I don't know that there's any problem with that. A lot of people think that some of the woods and stuff or whatever they use and the glues. Uh, here's what it says. It says, 
please help me and my wife by telling me what to do. Well, I'm not going to tell you what to do, Sandy Andy. You're going to have to figure it out yourself. Anyway, moving along, Evelyn Winchester, that bathing advice is some of the best info I've heard on YouTube anywhere. Thank you. So I did that when I was in the pickup truck, bathing when camper, when camping or living in a vehicle. Easy. Yeah, it is easy. It, it is. Uh, I, I, it, uh, I, I try. You got to, no matter how, what type of camping you're doing, uh, you need to keep clean. No kidding. Uh, driving for this is driving around here spinning wheels 2134 love the mumblings of a traveling texas man causing no harm well that's me babe carl stewart this is the best run campground i have ever stayed in and i've been rv camping for 35 plus years that's on the uh rudoso place called midtown mountain that's it the, they gave me this shirt midtown mountain uh, rv park yeah, it's a, it's a little pricey. It ain't cheap there, but it, it apparently it is well run. Thank you. Uh, RV Living with the Geezers got two. Check his channel out. Uh, he says, Rusty, no HEB in Fort Stockton. There's a Walmart close as HEB in Odessa at 150 miles. Well, I don't plan. You know, I could almost justify the trip. I was going to do a video about the prices here at the grocery store and, and in, in Alpine. Your cost of living here is not cheap. Okay, in, in uh, this West Texas area. Why? Because uh, the people that own the grocery stores, uh, porters, and the people that own the gasoline stations, I don't know who owns those, uh, they, they gouge a little bit, in my opinion. And because uh, yesterday I got some bananas and they were like, I want to say 80 cents a pound. And that's about 25 cents a pound more than uh, other stores uh, that I've shopped at recently, even including... Uh, uh, Capitan and New Mexico and gasoline's uh, three ninety nine a gallon and other parts of Texas it's well in Del Rio it's three twenty five that's seventy five cents a gallon and that's only two hundred miles away but anyway so yeah you, you're gonna pay overall for food you're gonna pay about twenty five to thirty percent more uh, for for food items and you're also gonna pay it for beer for beer for beer you're gonna pay about 25% more, and for wine, you're going to pay 50% more. I guarantee you. Here, here, here. But anyway, uh, also it says uh, Fort Davis has a very good hardware store at uh, Higginbotham Brothers. Turn on Douglas Avenue next to the Catholic Church. Okay, thank you, RB Living with the Geezer. Hopefully I won't need any hardware. Uh, D. Anderson, Rusty needs to find a nice old widow and steal her land from her. Just joking. <laughs> I'm hoping he finds a nice deal. Well, I, I, so far I haven't. The realtor we talked yesterday, and the lots that she's come up with are no bueno for me, or not good for me. And uh, yeah, but it, it's okay. I mean, I'm not worried about it. It's it's beautiful sunrise this morning. I will say that. No matter where I am in Fort Davis, if you can see the sunrise, you got it made. Because see, whenever there's clouds in the east, when the sun's coming up, it just adds flavor to the sunrise like right now you've got pinks and blues and all kind of stuff and it's pretty nice uh, i may do a video here in a minute if i remember uh, anyway moving along rusty move along uh cheap laugh kennedy sure is a beautiful ride rusty thanks for the ride along and your talk well i'm just talking to me guys and you're, if any of you are listening well that's that much better wtbm123 cool uh g reg's life's got two rusty the best video I like that you created was when you were on Mars. <laughs> yeah, well, check that out, you guys that haven't watched my Mars video. Just type in the Mars in the search field, and it'll come up. Same person, G-Reg's Life. Rusty, I know how organic your videos are. Yeah, well, they're organic, all right. I guarantee you uh, they're very organic. In fact, my the, I noticed all my analytics. Pew! <laughs> Go, but boom! <laughs> you know? You got, you know, people that watch YouTube, by and large, you know, they want you to, you know, jump off a cliff on your head or, or uh, you know, get caught in a tornado or something, you know. Tony Davidson, hi, Rusty. Thanks for the drive. Take us to see the observatory if you get a chance. Well, you're, we're going to go there. I'm going to go there today. You'll probably see it tomorrow. I may do two videos while I'm there because the drive there is really pretty. Uh, it's probably the prettiest drive in this area. It's Highway 118. And uh, and then when you get there, they have a uh, they have a movie theater 
and they also have two things you can drive to and look at and they also have a a really interesting gift shop i mean they've got some really scientific little toys and stuff and i'm they fascinate me you know uh, anyway i will i will don't worry tony it's coming shift into high if there were pine trees, it could be it would be Capitan. Well, it would, but uh, yeah, it, it would look very much like that for sure. Uh, this is Old Vines Inn. Hi, Rusty. I'm going to humbly add my two cents. Nearing 70 years old and knowing that the body ages and at some point sickness and disease will happen. Well, I don't know that. I don't go into I don't go into aging with that attitude. Uh, I always take into consideration the availability of health care in the vicinity where I decide to settle. I enjoy your videos. But what I plan to do, old vines in, is just stay healthy. And then when I'm not healthy, then I'll take care of my own self somehow. You know what I mean? Uh, Gary Ewing, Fort Davis, is one of my favorite places in Texas. Wonderful drive. Thank you. Craig Johnson, if Capitan was in Texas, I think you would be happy all the positive things you have said about Capitan, how easy to walk to everything you need, make a list of the positives and negatives, both places and decide. Well, yeah, I'm not going to give up on Capitan. I'll keep, I'll, I'll, uh, uh, hang on to that property more than likely the, the place in South Texas, uh, at Fort Clark Springs, I've got it up for sale, but you know, I'm not really all that excited about selling it. You know I mean? Uh, because starting, uh probably uh october uh it's it's october through may or april anyway it's very nice there great places to walk i love the little community i can go get me a breakfast uh, a taco and and they got a little grocery store no it's it's fine i'm riding my electric trike all over everywhere anyway moving along moving along uh tony davidson hi rusty hi tony time zone got your name driving he says i'm about your age and these are the kind of places i would look at yeah well you know what else are you going to do at my age you know i mean you know, i'm not going to go get on a cruise ship i'm not going to get on a bus and go somewhere and as far as uh you know driving long distances and stuff in the motor home i'm not real excited about that either even though i can and could uh but no i just enjoy i'm trying to enjoy life my way okay and that's it uh blue feather way to go rusty Good to see you're doing well. Greetings from the Midwest, Iowa, and the Mississippi. Glad to hear you got a spot with no barking dogs. Number one on your list and mine, too. Looks like a peaceful place, and I'm glad to see your smiling face. Nice to see you're consistent in your videos. Really is cool that you can keep us entertained. Well, yeah, you know, it, it's, a, it's what it is. It is a beautiful sunrise, and uh, I try to show it to you, but there's a glare on the window, and... Uh, yeah, I may walk out there when I finish this and we'll do a short sunrise. Anyway, thank you, Blue Feather. Uh, Dogman Chronicles, check that channel out. Very pretty country. Thanks for the ride along and talk, Rusty. Pretty, P-U-R-R-T-Y. Very good, Jim. <laughs> Your spelling has improved. Bobber Guy 1 on Fort Davis, walking. Is Fort Davis built on top of oil, gold, or taken over by a Mexican cartel? I don't know. He says home prices from two hundred fifty thousand to a million plus. The two hundred fifty thousand dollar homes are valued around a hundred thousand in my neck of the woods. Guess I'm in the wrong woods or not? No, what it is, uh, this became a little uh, touristy area, and and folks pay a premium. And and believe me, there are <laughs> you ain't gonna buy anything cheap here. Uh-uh. Jerry Stalvey, Rusty, you did good, son. That was on Alamogordo to Cloudcroft, New Mexico, driving. Well, thank you, Jerry. This is Lisa G. on comment call. Yep, I remember those days when you did wine tastings to supplement your Social Security income. Yeah, uh, and that was fun. I enjoyed that. I'm, I'm always going to be doing something. You know, my <laughs> you know, I was using YouTube and Amazon to supplement my uh Social Security income, but it looks like it's going to be <laughs> flatlined, e even money. Uh, anyway, Dogman Chronicles, good comment call. Check that channel out. Thank you, Jim. JJ, JJ, they, I didn't notice any road noise at all, concentrating on the fantastic scenery. Love your videos. Well, thank you, JJ. I'm E88. Congratulations, Rusty. I started watching you when you had 6,000 subscribers. I still go back once in a while to watch the old videos. 
where you take time to answer viewer questions. Well, I take time now. I mean, I still do comment calls. You mean the live, when I used to do the live video stuff? I did a few live streams, but it, it doesn't work well for me. It, it's, uh, you have to have somebody helping you almost to do that. Mark Reynolds, nice scenic drive, pretty country out here. I wonder how the winters are here. Enjoy your day. The winters are fairly mild, but they do get a little snow, not much, very little. Anyway, uh, I, would I live here year-round? Year sure. Not a question about here. Lisa G., love that turnstile at the gate of the courthouse as if they're trying to delay hordes of people from whipping in and out of there at a massive rate. Yeah, they get two people a day, you know, I mean, yeah, it's a beautiful sunrise. Anyway, Lucy Foster says, uh, hi, Rusty, the money, the money to you app is right in line with the thumbs up app. Have a look. It is inside a heart. Best wishes. Well, I guess that, uh, is a new thing YouTube is doing is allow allowing people to help creators by using that money to you app. Anyway, thank whoever somebody a couple of you have used it and thank you. Thank you, Lucy, for the info. Uh Silver Turtle 65, life is good, especially when you're getting 40 plus MPG and Sparky. Yeah, I'm averaging 45.5 now. In at Capitan, I was ordering Averaging 47.5, so two miles per gallon down. Sherry Hooker, I appreciate the ride-along and inter interesting observation. Thanks, Rusty. Well, good. I'm glad you do. I'm glad somebody does. And <laughs> not very many. Uh, anyway, Raccoon Little Bear, nice drive around. <clears throat> that did look a lot like New Mexico on the way in. Yeah, it, uh, it well, we're just uh, 150 miles from the border or less. K, K, Air, K, Key Air Jada, I guess. Everyone needs more than their salary to be financially stable. The best thing to do with your money is in, to invest it right, rightly because money left for saving always ends up with no, used ret no return. Uh, I, I don't know. I, I think you got to be careful investing your money. This is some trick here, I have a feeling. Yeah, it's a deal for Albert. It's a scam. Yeah, they, they they get on your channel, crank in a bunch of replies, and then uh, uh, you know you and if you want if you want to invest your money, my recommendation is not be in the stock market, okay? Because that thing's going to go up and down, and when you need your money, it may be down, and it may stay down for a while like it is now. Uh, anyway, uh, Raccoon Little Bear, nice drive around. Oh, that did look like New Mexico. On the way in, I reckon I probably read that. Wayne Johnson, enjoy your looking around. Thank you. Uh, here we got uh, Sashi Smith. Hi, Rusty. Nice drive and share. Plus informative. Beautiful area. Geezer's old stomping gown. Yeah, no, he used to live here. I don't know. He, he moved somewhere. Uh, Tejas Rob. I remember that Olympia Estates from RV Living with the Geezer's channel. Ain't that where the Republic of Texas Desperado holed up and had a shootout with the DPS back in the 90s? No, that was uh, that was Davis Mountains Resort. Uh, I think it is. It made national news. No, that was out at Davis Mountains Resort, and they're still there. Or that mindset. Uh, William Bingham, I remember those Sunday drives, picnics, and state park visits with my family as a child. Sunday's coming down. Yeah, great memories. Yeah, thank you, William. We'll do two more. Don Hensley, Rusty, check out Tom Moreland, Chuck Wagons, and Fort Davis. Okay, I'll see what I can do about that. And last one here, Ken Price or Priest. This drive was just like a Trike Man adventure. Can you bring Trike Man? Can you bring back Trike Man, please? Well, Trike Man's trike is in uh, Fort Clark Springs. If I go back down there, we'll go triking. Okay, how about that? Yeah, but anyway, having said that, guys, from a beautiful sunrise here in uh, Fort Davis, Texas, this is Rusty78609. Well, I'll give you a goat kiss. This goat, this goat here must be sick. The two eared goat. Doesn't work. Maybe the battery's dead. But this one works. Give you a two ear a one ear go kiss. So having done that, thumbs up, ladies and gentlemen. Carpe diem. Carpe diem means seize the day. Carpe diem adios. Bye bye. Buy anything you want anytime. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Why? Because it doesn't cost you a penny. Just click on the link and go to Amazon and buy whatever you choose. Yeah, everything else is tanking. That might as well tank, too. <laughs> anyway, what else? Drink plenty of water, three or four quarts a day. Uh, 
uh, won't hurt you. It's good for you. It'll help you avoid gout, kidney stones. Also help you lose weight because you'll be full of water and you will not want to eat so much as a snack. You know what I mean. And the only way to lose weight and keep it off is da -da 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 -da. eat less. That's it. I mean, what else? Uh, well, let's see. I did said take deep breaths. Breathe in really deep, hold it for a few seconds, and then breathe out slowly. Why? Because that relieves stress. Relieving stress lowers your blood pressure, and that's good for you. Do it several times a day. And then, doot, 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 stretch, stretch, stretch. Swivel, swivel, swivel. Walk, walk, walk. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Exercise your body once or twice a day, every single day. Why? Because you'll feel better immediately, and you may uh, feel better. You'll feel better immediately, and you may live longer, healthier because of that one thing. And then what else? Stand guard at the door of your mind. Do not let negativity in. This is your head, your brain, your frontal lobes, your consciousness. All those little neurons in there are forming neural links, which is every single thought you have. So give your personal neurons positive stuff to work with. How about that? That'll work. And then what else? Accentuate the positive. Eliminate the negative. Enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time. At ease. Carry on. Adios. Bye-bye. Hasta luego. Vaya con Dios. Aloha. Until the noon video, which will be driving over towards Marfa. I actually went into the town of Marfa, so you'll get to see a little bit of that. Eventually, I'll go walk Alpine. I'll go walk Marfa, and uh, on and on we go. Adios, guys.